Okay, so here we are at my piano, and uh, and I want to encourage you this week, if you're not a piano player, or even if you are, um, you really can't go wrong with this, um, to play as many scales as you can, whether you have a real piano or a virtual piano on a tablet, um, or you want to just use the virtual piano at musictheory.net, they have one there as well. Um, just being able to physically like plunk out some scales makes a huge difference. I can't tell you how many times in my music theory courses, how many times I was visualizing in my head um, a particular scale, like what what was in the degrees of the scale, what's part of the key signature, what's not, um, distances between two notes, those kinds of things. Um, so so play some scales, have a little fun. Um, I'm going to include some links in the slide after this um, for a website that includes diagrams with exactly what notes are in every single kind of scale you could think of. Um, major, natural, har harmonic and melodic minors, um, all of them are just there. So you can even take those diagrams out, put it on a tablet or on a computer and just and just play through them and kind of get uh, get them under your fingers and into your brain. So uh, so here's the first one. I'm going to try to uh, do the uh, the whole steps and half steps for each of those four types of scales. Um, so you kind of have a basis to work on. They are all the same. So uh, somewhere across the top of this screen, Logan be very impressed with my technological capabilities right now. I'm very proud. We're going to have the whole steps and half steps. And as you know, the uh, the major scale is whole whole half whole 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 half. No matter what note you start on, I'm going to take it easy on myself and start right there on C. So our C major scale, or really any major scale, has whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, whole step, half step. Okay, and feel free to use this method if you're not a pianist and you have no desire to be. If you prefer to actually use some fingering, there are places um, on, on the internet that you can see those. I can direct you uh, to, to those places or you can email me with any questions, I can answer them. Okay, so that's our major scale. Now for natural, or natural minor scales, I'm gonna pop down here to no sharps and no flats on A minor. So for your natural minor scales, your combination is gonna be whole half, whole whole half, whole whole. Very different, right? So we've got whole, Again with regular old fingering. Oh, Coda singing along. How sweet. And then we have harmonic minor. Harmonic minor is the same as natural minor but with a raised seventh. So uh, your whole steps and half steps will be whole half, whole whole half, just like your natural minor, followed by what I'm going to say is either one and a half steps or minor third, okay? It's three half steps put together and then ending with a half step. So here's what your harmonic minor would look like. Here's that minor third or three half steps. Okay, so you can see the three half steps. One, two, three. And then a half step to the end. Okay, and all together just to see it in context. Whoops. Let's try that again. There we go. I blame the dog at my feet chewing the bone and distracting me. <laughs> And then the last one for now is melodic minor. It's probably the least common. Sorry about the dog bone chewing in the background. There he goes. <laughs> um, mo melodic minor is different on the way up than on the way down. So we'll do on the way up first. Um, on the way up, it's almost like a major scale on the top half. You're gonna have whole, half, whole, whole, and then continue with the whole steps. But on the way down, you revert back to this whole steps and half steps from the natural minor. So we go down with whole, whole, half, whole, whole, half, whole. So in context, all the way together. half steps and whole steps and uh, and if that's helpful to you I can include um, kind of the list of half steps and whole steps and what they should be or just use the diagrams on the websites attached.